Hi everyone, just come to share with you another journal that I've completed. Um, this is another soft cover journal and it measures eight and a half by six. It's got one signature and I've done it with a hint of black. Um, I used a clasp envelope for the cover, then I used some tissue paper um, that I had and I think I got it from the range and I can't it wasn't in its packaging so I can't remember what it was called and I only had a little bit left so I used that you can kind of see it there it had a Paris theme to it um, <clears throat> this lovely rosette trim here uh, used this little girl image there uh, stitched that uh, made a fabric ruffle and put on a few layers of lace and some eyelash trim and then this um, vintage looking button it isn't actually vintage it just kind of looks vintage i've used this um, uh, lace to tie it up which can come off completely there is uh, 80 pages front and back and let's go inside <clears throat> so i've just put some um, squared paper on the inside cover a little bit of washi um, stamped this and put that there done some stitching on some of the pages and I've used digital kits from Tsunami Rolls, Artie Mays and Cameo Shop and we'll do a quick flip and that flips up. It's very much like my last journal that i done because I printed out loads thinking I was going to use it all in one journal and I didn't. So <clears throat> there is plenty of room to journal, there's Plenty of tuck spots. Done some stencil and used the honeycomb stencil. <clears throat> used this um, fuzzy kind of fiber trim here. Lots of ephemera throughout. Made some little flip up, flip downs, and of course I've glued them. I don't think I glued anything on the last one. <laughs> uh, just some postcard ephemera, some Artie Mays. This is from Tsunami Rose. And it just pops in there. Here I've just made a pocket and used some of these calendars. This is just folded in half pops in there you can actually pop something in there as well I've uh, got this black trim here some ledger paper doily Edith Holden book page here we've just got a, a tuck there and that flips up and flips down some more pockets with ephemera Oh, more ephemera. I'm not going to pull everything out. It takes me ages to put it all back in. This is double. This actually opens up. <clears throat> Another flip here. More ephemera. Uh, paper bag. Some of this eye eyelash trim. Hearts on a string. Another, that's a corner flip, some more ephemera, a little file folder from Tsunami Rose. And that is that. <laughs> Another pocket. And that just goes back in there. Some more ephemera here. flips up and flips down, it's also a pocket. There's some more ephemera here. Another pocket with ephemera and that flips out like that, so you can journal on the back of that. little 
flip up, flip down. Some more ephemera. Some more of that trim. Uh, this is a little fold ephemera. Love that, that's really sweet. And another envelope. And that is the back. I've left it open, that's why the um, lace has not been attached. Because I can never work that out when you want to leave that open, how to do it. So <laughs> I've just left it like that. So that is the journal. This will be listed on my Etsy. Um, if you have any questions, just ask. And thanks for watching. Bye.